Well, the holiday season is coming to a close, but many of us are still in the process of cleaning up after the chaos in our living room's Christmas morning. Decorated trees are still standing tall and garbage cans are busting at the brim waiting to be unloaded. If this sounds like your home, what's your plan? CTV's Joe Perkins shows us how you can deliver one last Christmas present to the planet. It's a post-Christmas routine John Dietrich has been seeing out for the past seven years. <laughs> I've got a conscience, I guess. Uh, the items he's recycling could have gone into his garbage at home and would have saved him a trip, but... If it just goes into your garbage can at home, it's going to go straight to Heartland Landfill. There is a finite lifespan with the landfill, and we know too much now as a population that it's not good to put things into the ground that aren't biodegradable. With Christmas wrapping up. Cardboard boxes, uh, TVs, styrofoam, uh, batteries, kids' toys. Those Christmas leftovers need to go somewhere. How about a blue bin? There's 13 bins, I believe, 13 or 14 bins. Mm -hmm. Only three will actually go to the landfill from our facility. Most items are recycled. Some things, including old Christmas lights, are sold off. Uh, these go to, uh, you know, our metals brokers on the, on the mainland. Need to get rid of that clunky styrofoam clogging up your garbage. We throw it into this side. It breaks up all the material. Then it goes up the chute, across the pipe, down to our densifier on the other side of the wall. What do you say when you fire it up? <laughs> Pretty much just fire it up. <laughs> Let's go. Stand back. <laughs> Stand back. Let's go. All right. From large white blocks to even heavier white blocks. This is the finished product here. Oh, that's heavy, eh? These large crates of recycled styrofoam are bound for the international market, where they will soon be recycled into number six plastics, the same plastic used to make coffee cup lids. This would equivalent into, I don't know how many trucks going to the landfill, but it would be, it would be a lot. For a small fee, recycling depots such as Ellis Recycling will take almost all of your Christmas waste. In most cases, if you name it, there's a bin for it. Just ask the drywall guys. This year are getting rid of more than just drywall. All right. Until next year. Until next year. Joe Perkins, CTV News, Victoria.